stay on us, indefinitely detaining us, uh, shipping us to another country if they want to uh, torture us. And, of course, you'll just disappear. That was what his family saw. They, they didn't know what had happened to him. He just disappeared one day. Going up here this summer, just, you know, it's about a mile from my house. I went through that, and I wouldn't roll the window down all the way, and the guy's hollering at me, calling me a sovereign. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's, that's what they've been told. See, it's, it's terms like a sovereign citizen, terms like a constitutionalist. That's why everyone was so concerned about that videotape. It was not taken out of context. The real context is that the Southern Poverty Law Center is using those types of terms to demonize people. And again, we've seen in scenarios that they even use the term Tea Party to try to portray people as being dangerous. Thank you so much, Bob. I'm glad you survived that uh, encounter with the SWAT team in Maine. Again, that's uh, Bob from Maine. He had his house SWAT teamed and he wasn't the guy they were looking for, yet they put his face on television. They put him face down on the ground, nearly killed him with a SWAT team. Let's go to uh, John in Colorado. John, you want to talk about the marijuana laws there? No, oh, I think we missed him. That's too bad. I wanted to ask him about that. Let's go to Kevin in, in West Virginia. Uh, you said you want to talk about the Beware program. Um, yeah, um, I was wondering if we as citizens could have our own little beware program and kind of do the same thing that they're doing and point out what police officers are um, corrupt or what police officers are not actually for the Constitution. But my question then is, is that going to add fuel to the fire um, with an us versus them type of mentality? Well, that's true. I, you know, I think that there needs to be citizen oversight of uh, the police. And as we were talking to Matt Shea, he said there ought to be citizen over, there ought to be separate uh, outside investigators whenever there's a possibility of uh, police brutality, excessive use of force. Whenever there's a shooting, there ought to be an open public trial, not a closed uh, grand jury investigation. And there ought to be uh, an outside prosecutor. And we ought to have oversight of the police in terms of their training as well. So I think it would be appropriate to uh, start looking at uh, the, the postings of the police. And if they're posting stuff up that is threatening, and we've seen that, a lot of, uh, of the repostings from the Ask a Cop were some very in-your-face postings from the police. And, of course, uh, they put out that T-shirt that we had an article up on Infowars.com yesterday. They've got a, uh, a shirt that they're putting out, a law enforcement insignia. It says, uh, uh, breathe easy. Obey the law. Essentially the same thing that Art Acevedo said here in Austin. Hey, if uh, the, the cop tells you to do something, just do it and you won't get hurt. Well, do we have to mow their lawn? Do we have to lick their boots? What do we have to do? That, that's that article up right now for anybody that's watching. Uh, Pro police, breathe easy t-shirt draws the ire of brutality posters. Just obey the law. You won't be beaten or murdered. Unless the cops feel like it. That's the article that's up on our, our website, Infowars.com. You can see that article. And I guess, really, we should uh, point this out. And, and it was actually, uh, Kevin, it was actually police inside the uh, Spokane Sheriff's Office who blew the whistle on the fact that the Southern Poverty Law Center was there propagandizing the Sheriff's Department. So there are good cops who are not going to be doing that type of uh, thing that we just saw up there. They're not going to be threatening the population, and they're going to be blowing the whistle when you've got somebody like the Southern Poverty Law Center coming in teaching some very dangerous stuff. So I don't think that that necessarily escalates things. I think there needs to be a dialogue back and forth to the police, don't you? I, I totally do. Um, hey, my uncle is an ex-retired um, um, police officer um, for Anne Arundel County, Maryland. Um, he was head of narcotics division, and uh, he wrote a book about um, the corruption in the Anne Arundel County, Maryland Police Department. Um, he hasn't published his book, but he has given me a copy of it, and all the names are not changed or anything. But I was wondering, is that something you guys would be interested in looking at, or... Uh, certainly, if you've got a link to it where we could look at it or if it's been published, yeah, send that to uh, showtips at infowars.com. I'd appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, let's go to uh, Will and FEMA 8. Will, you said you want to talk about toy guns? Uh, actually, that's FEMA 5. Oh, FEMA 5. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, um, yeah and of course, hearing the um, one caller prior on the uh, mistaken identity, yeah, I had that even, even though it wasn't with the police, thank goodness, uh, partially with the... Uh, by one bank I was with, same name, uh, and actually also the same last four Soch that they looked up me by. And what did they do at the bank? When I was 
needing to get into my account, and all I had was my uh, debit card. Mm -hmm. They looked up my name. They asked for my last four of my SOCH, and they actually had to confirm my location of where I live because there was another person with my name yes. and the last four of my SOCH in their system. Yes, yes, absolutely. Yeah, it's a very dangerous and, thing, and, it, and it's not just getting names mixed up. When we're talking about this Beware program, the real Beware program that, they, that the federal government pays uh, $36,000 a year for the police departments to have, they can go in and who knows what the assumptions are that they're making in order to assign a threat level of red, yellow, or green to you. I mean, that really begs a lot of questions when they're giving out threat assessments, essentially not just telling the police that everybody uh, the, in the general population is out to kill them, but then assigning a color to you, telling them that you're a threat. How do they know that you're a threat? What are their fundamental assumptions? There's a lot of possibility for false positives and that a very dangerous situation going even beyond invading your home with the SWAT teams. We'll be right back with your call. Stay with us. I'm watching and waiting for the right time to take everything you own. I love a dark house. Don't be the next victim of a break-in. Go to faketv.com and discover a device that creates the illusion someone is inside watching TV and makes your home unappealing to would-be thieves. Don't these people ever leave? Starting at $24.95 and there's free shipping. Go to faketv.com or ask for it at your local hardware store. Fake TV, the burglar deterrent. Silver has always been nature's very own antibiotic, and only one system allows you to generate an endless supply of natural silver solutions. SilverLungs.com. You'll find no wild claims or pseudoscience, just a lifetime of nano-sized pure silver solutions. The Silver Lungs generator allows you to make your own, so stop paying for silver solutions. The unique lung delivery system targets respiratory infections where other silver solutions simply cannot reach. See the Silver Lungs generator and lung delivery system at SilverLungs.com. That's SilverLungs.com. Sold out for weeks due to the difficult and extensive proprietary process behind its creation, the exclusive InfoWars Life Secret 12 formulation is now back in stock in the last limited shipment of 2014, the most bioactive form that has been created with our proprietary process. This ultra-clean vitamin B12 nutraceutical has been carefully crafted and developed over the last two years and is based on cellular science of how your body actively absorbs essential nutrients. Secret 12 is taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Vitamin B12 deficiency is linked to scores of serious problems. And Secret 12 is a fusion of two organic proprietary forms of vitamin B12, bringing you a true nutraceutical quality vitamin B12. Secret 12. Secret 12 is an excellent Christmas gift and is tailor-made to boost your New Year's resolutions. Supplies of Secret 12 are very limited. Secure yours today at InfoWarsLife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139. It's very easy to be a criminal. All you need to burglarize a home is one simple household tool, a pair of scissors. If your home security system can be compromised by a criminal using scissors, then you're making it easy for them. Almost every home security system, even those sold by big name companies, has a weakness. The phone line. You shell out 1500 bucks, get locked into a long-term contract, and think you're safe. But a burglar can destroy your alarm in seconds with one snip. And when a burglar cuts your phone line, you you're defenseless. Simply Safe Home Security is the smarter choice. Built by Harvard engineers, Simply Safe uses a wireless connection to call the cops. Scissors can't cut it, and that means your home stays safe. 24/7 professional monitoring is under $15 a month with no contract. Simply Safe Home Security keeps you safer than the other guys for half the cost. Protect your home with the alarm you can trust. Simply Safe. Go to simplysafedefense.com now for an exclusive 10% offer. That's simplysafedefense.com. The Alex Jones Show. I'm David Knight, your host today here in Austin. We tried to reach uh, Alex, who is going to call in from the road, but he's in an area where we could not reach him. He will be back on Sunday, however, at the 4 p.m. Central Show between uh, 4 to 6 on uh, Sunday. Of course, that's uh, 5 to 7 Eastern Time. He has extended the special that we had earlier this week. We can no longer guarantee Christmas delivery, but we've had such overwhelming response. We decided that we would make it available to people. Uh, it looks like there's a, a lot of demand for this that uh, do it as a favor to the people who support us. This is $59.99 for the Essential Holiday Pack, 
Secret 12, X2 Nascent Iodine, and Silver Bullet. That's only about $20 each. That's a savings of nearly $80, 57% off. We're still going to make that available, although we can no longer guarantee uh, Christmas delivery. You might get it. We're not sure. Let's go back to your calls in this uh, last segment we have here. Steve in Michigan. Go ahead, Steve. Hello? Hey, Hello? go ahead. Uh, yeah, I've been a longtime listener and supporter of your program, and I've been tuning in to talk about the FEMA camps and the red and blue list mm -hmm. and about how the NSA tracks everything we can do, watches your show and who's calling in. And uh, last night I was listening to, I guess it was a rebroadcast, and Alex was talking about how they are and why they are letting uh, InfoWars go on. But I think there's one thing that everybody's overlooking. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mm -hmm. uh, what they're doing is the NSA knows everybody that calls into your show. They know their name. They know where they live. They know everything about them. So essentially, the obvious reason that they're letting you guys go on and they're not going to touch Alex until the very end is because you're essentially calling the herd for them. Well, let me say this. If we're going to get so afraid of the government, and listen, they're watching everything you do anywhere. If you want to take it to the logical conclusion, you don't have to just call into this show to get onto their radar. They're listening to you through your monitors. They're listening to you through your phones. Are you going to shut up and not say anything to anybody in your home? We cannot cower in fear before these people. The only thing that's going to stand it down is to stand up to them. Don't cower in fear before them. Don't censor yourself. If you start censoring yourself, we've lost at that point. Then we're in a true Stasi East Germany state at the point where we're so afraid of the government that we won't speak up. Of course, they're listening to everything everybody does. Let me tell you, when we were at the Bundy Ranch, Josh and I could not get any reception at the site where the protest was. It was away from the Bundy Ranch. We had to go back to the Bundy Ranch or to our hotel in order to upload anything or to uh, get any coverage because they had a, a Wi-Fi system there. And they said, that's really strange because we've always had cell phone uh, coverage out there. Well, we couldn't get any. Then on Saturday, when they had everybody show up for the protest, we had great reception. We could broadcast everything there at that site. And of course, they had stepped up the reception so they could get the information from everybody that was there. Did we know that? Of course we did. Were we afraid of it? No, we weren't. None of the people that were there cared. You know what? You got to get to the point where you don't care about the tyrants. If they've got you cowering in fear, uh, thinking that they're culling the herd, if you speak out, that they're watching you constantly, know that they're watching you constantly and still do something about it. That's what you need to do. Uh, let's go to uh, Lewis in Massachusetts. Lewis, you want to talk about the pellet gun shooting? Go ahead. Hey, how's it going, David? Doing good. Yeah, um, so, so this ties in with what Joe Biggs was talking about, how the cops are acting more like the military. So um, I, I was watching the news the other day, and there was this guy who was shot for uh, carrying a Pelican. Yes. And, yeah, basically what happened was that he bought a Pelican at, like, a Walmart or whatever. Oh, well, he was standing there. He hadn't even bought it yet. He was just talking to his wife on the cell phone. It's absolutely out. Sorry we ran out of time. I don't, I, I, I'd like to take your call, and I'm sorry I apologize to the callers who are still on the line. Join us tonight for the nightly news at 7 Central. Alex will be back 4 Central on Sunday. Join us then. This is GCN, the Genesis Communications Radio Network. Sold out for weeks due to the difficult and extensive proprietary process behind its creation, the exclusive InfoWars Life Secret 12 formulation is now back in stock in the last limited shipment of 2014. The most bioactive form that has been created with our proprietary process. This ultra-clean vitamin B12 nutraceutical has been carefully crafted and developed over the last two years and is based on cellular science of how your body actively absorbs essential nutrients. Secret 12 is taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Vitamin B12 deficiency is linked to scores of serious problems. And Secret 12 is a fusion of two organic proprietary forms of vitamin B12, bringing you a true nutraceutical quality vitamin B12, Secret 12. Secret 12 is an excellent Christmas gift and is tailor-made to boost your New Year's resolutions. Supplies of Secret 12 are very limited. Secure yours today at InfoWars Life.
www.ghostofmidnightlife.com or by calling toll-free 888-253-3139.